Virtual reality technologies enable us to accomplish many things that might not be possible in the physical world. And this research explores one such magic, selecting fully occluded targets in virtual reality. The presence of fully occluded targets is common within virtual environments. Structural elements like walls can easily hide and prevent users from accessing the object behind them. In another example, high dimensional visualizations are also likely to obscure an element of interest from being acquired by observers. However, existing selection techniques in VR are limited in their effectiveness for selecting fully occluded targets. Therefore, we developed a set of potential techniques for fully occluded target selection in VR and evaluated their performance through two user studies. This video demonstrates the 10 selection techniques proposed by us and the two possible application scenarios of these techniques. In Nafa cursor, we embed a mobile cursor onto the selection ray. The objects start disappearing as the cursor goes deeper and reappearing as it comes closer. The selection ray can be used to point and select the desired object. With flower comb, users select the objects in two phases. They first control comb to match the estimated area of where the target might occur, and then select the target on the grid layout. Gravity zone can translate all objects in the scene to come closer or further away, and if the distance between an object and the user is smaller than a threshold, the object will become fully transparent. Grid wall can rearrange all the objects in scene onto a grid layout. It completely reorganizes all objects to a new location and users can select the target on the grid by pointing at it. With lasso grid, users can draw a trace in any shape by long pressing the trigger. All objects within the trace will be presented on the grid layout when releasing the trigger for the second stage of selection. Magic Ball creates a 3D minimap for all selectable objects inside a transparent sphere. Users can select directly on the object proxies by moving the tip of the virtual stick onto the mini object and pressing the trigger. Smash Pro spreads objects to a random location if there is more than one object intersects with the ray. The objects are translated back to their original position after a predefined time. Based on our study results, we further developed three techniques by refining the most promising ones mentioned before. Gravity Zone Plus, derived from Gravity Zone, allows an easier control of cursor movement speed. Lasso Grade Plus originates from Lasso Grade, employs a more organized way of arranging the objects onto the grade layout. It also adds 3D features onto the 2D grade surface and enables selection enhancements for target acquisition. Magic Ball Plus, a derivative of Magic Ball, now enables group selection and is combined with a grid feature for the ease of selection. Based on our findings, we have developed two proof-of-concept demonstrations in VR showing the techniques in real application scenarios. The first demo mimics a 3D modeling scenario, where users can reveal fully occluded targets with alpha cursor and perform consequent manipulations like translation and rotation. The second demo shows an ocean exploration scenario in VR. Users can select an animal of interest which lives in certain areas or is hidden by corals to delve into its detailed information. Now here comes the squid. Ah, um, interesting. Let me explore more about these underwater creatures. <laughs> 